Hey there! Uh, previously we have talked about the keyboard and pitch, we've talked about whole steps and half steps, and we've talked about letter names and accidentals. Today we are going to talk about the staff and ledger lines. Now, the staff is simply five lines and four spaces and we write notes on the staff. So a note could be a space note like that or it could be a line note. It's whatever runs through the middle of the note. So this is not a line note because it sits on a line. Some students think that. No, this is a line note because a line goes through the middle of the note. This is a space note because, you know, a space goes through the middle. Notes can be filled in or they can be not filled in. They can have stems and flags and stuff. We will talk about that later. But that's the basic idea with staff. Notes go on these five lines and four spaces. And actually, we can go beyond the staff. Here's the top space in the staff. Here's the top line in this staff. Well, if we go up one more, it'll be another space note because we alternate space, line, space. Then we have a line note, but we're out of lines, so we just add a line just for this note. That line is called a ledger line. You can also spell this with a D, but this is this way is better. So you can have a ledger line which extends the staff above or below the regular five lines and four spaces. You can have a space note beneath a ledger line, or you can have a space note above a ledger line. And that's all there is to it as far as a staff. Five lines, four spaces, and a ledger line extends the staff even farther above or below. All right? Have a great day.